episode cooking with Jay. What is? We, we're having uh, steak, mass homemade mashed potatoes, garlic mashed potatoes with. Uh, it's roasted some, garlic. Yeah, rusty. Roasted garlic. garlic. I'm sorry. Messer. And uh, tongue tied. Uh, and uh, some broccoli. And for frying some um, corn, I mean, not corn, carrots. I'm going to put some carrots inside there t- with the broccoli. So, right now I got my uh, potatoes boiling. Waiting for the done to get done. Then I'm going to put these in the oven. A little oil on top of them and let them get soft. And once the mashed potatoes get done, I'll take and put that in there, mash them up with some cream cheese, sour cream, and some, uh, what else it was? Sour cream and... Whipping cream. Yeah, the whipping cream. Whipping cream, whipping cream. And then I'm taking to put the steaks on the grill outside. I got a pellet grill outside warming up as so, like so. And um, then we'll see y'all after that. What kind of seasoning do you put on your steaks? Uh, I got you. Some Mr. Dash, some Obey, not Obey, I'm sorry, uh, Adobe, some Adobe, and some um, all-purpose all seasoning. Adobe, all-purpose seasoning, Mrs. Dash, and what else do you say? And some uh, all-purpose seasoning. I said that. Okay. What was the first thing you said? Adobe, Mrs. Dash, and uh, all-purpose. All-purpose. It's four things you said. I don't know. Oh, well. I don't know. And a little hole. And a little bit of brown sugar, brown sugar bourbon. Okay. So we're gonna put those on there while the potatoes are trying to continue. I don't like my steaks all the way done, but I just get them a little bit. But they should be okay. Alright. Okay. Pellet grill. Just let it sit there for and let us do this thing. No charcoal, just pellets. This is the white salmon. Yeah, I might get a little closer with the heat there. Oak wood, so it can get that taste in it. Yep. I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie that I die 
Okay now, I'm about to make my broccoli. This is cocoa oil. I'm gonna saute my broccoli in here. Uh, it's only three of us here, but I was cooking for my neighbor too because he helps me out a lot, so I'm treating him to uh, dinner. I, well, I, the wife and me are treating him to dinner, cooking him a steak. Give him a normal bag of broccoli. Great bag. It's that Walmart. Finest. What, what we use it called, Walmart? Wally Word. Wally Word. We're going to just throw these in here like this. Hot, not really hot, yeah, but once it gets it's get the kitchen, we uh, ain't. I'm out for it. Put the whole bag in there. Yeah, I'm out for the whole bag in there. I thought that's what you were gonna do. Oh, a lot of ice. Eat that breeze. It's alright. You're right. So, like so. All seasoning. All purpose seasoning. See, you gonna have to. You're about to be out. Yeah. And a little black pepper. And so, Mrs. Dash. And we just give it a chance to start cooking. Yeah, you get juicing on there. Say it juicing. <laughs> juicing. Put some more. Yeah. All the season on there. Probably put a little bit more salt on there. Ready. I guess uh, y'all see the plates pretty soon. First, just want to say thank you to my wonderful husband for cooking such a delicious meal. Oh my gosh, a girl was so stuffed. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big old thumbs up. And please show my husband some love down in the comments below. Um, what do you guys think of the meal? And hey, if you have not subscribed to the Happy Hill Homestead, then we would love if you would join our family. All you have to do is click that red word subscribe, make it turn gray, and don't forget to click on the post notification notification bell and we will see you guys in the next one bye thanks for stopping by the happy hill homestead please like comment subscribe and share our channel and help our family grow we'll see you in the next one